know who's man's. <laughs> <laughs> what's going on guys and welcome to the vlog today is a very special day because we are finally starting the process of getting the coupe painted and i'm so so excited for this because the paint that's on it is so bad and yours truly did it uh, i just destroyed it and i will never <laughs> do this again um unless i actually learn how to do it properly but i i butchered the whole front end of this car it just looks so bad you can clearly see the half and half difference between the colors this is good and that's me it's bad it's got to get fixed i am sticking with this color because i love it so much so the whole car is going to look like this side which i'm so happy for it because i love this color so much um i would just get this half painted but if we do that it's going to make this half look different still because this paint's older so the whole car has got to get painted which means we got to sand the entire thing get it all prepped take off a bunch of panels and stuff that we don't want painted and just really prep the entire car you guys remember my friend steve he was here when we were talking about painting it the last video when i was going over the wheels he's going to be with me today i'm going to go to their shop and we're gonna get this thing completely taken care of in terms of sanding and prepping and all this stuff. At least I hope we do. Um, we're gonna try and bang it out all in one day, but if we can't, then we'll do more in another episode and then we'll send it off to paint. So I'm so happy. I remember in the video when Steve was here, we were talking about painting the car ourselves. We have decided because it's very hard to find a good location to paint the car and a compressor and all the you know things like that. Um, that we're just gonna send it to Mako and I know that there are opinions about Mako and I have them as well um, There's a particular Mako very close to me that I have known about for a long time and Their staff is very nice and they've been there for years and I trust them So I'm going to send this car to Mako and I really hope that they do a good job now yesterday I already went to Mako and I got the estimate for the whole thing. I've decided to not go with the basic paint just because it's basic paint and I don't want it to, you know, wither away after two years. So I've decided to go with the Step Up which has enamel in it which is a little bit tougher and resists chipping and stuff like that. Especially since this is my daily still, I'm going to be driving it every day and I just don't want to have a bunch of rock chips everywhere. So. <laughs> that's how it's gonna be. The total after tax for the preferred paint with uh, primer and paint with them doing that came out to like 820 or something like that, um, which actually really isn't that bad. I was expecting well over a grand. Um, with us doing the prep work and them primering and painting the car, that's not that bad. I can, I can deal with that. So without further ado, let's go get some stuff because we have a big list of prep things that we have to go get and uh, we got to get them now, so let's do it. All right, so we got quite a big list uh, to get here at Lowe's. You guys remember Steve, my friend, in the last video that involved paint. Uh, he sent me a list of everything that I need to get this prep done. So I need a DA sander. I need the grits for it. I need 80, 180, 320. I need red scuff pads, body filler, aircraft stripper, masking tape, masking paper, etc., etc., all this stuff. So I'm gonna go inside Lowe's and we're gonna see what we can find. Eighty, one eighty, and three twenty. paper so I also need some filler primer for doing the body work for the dents and stuff and I think that this is for me two-in-one filler sandable so I think that'll work get a couple cans of this breaking the bank here just looking at this one Yeet. $35 later, we got the stuff. 
Look at this bitch leaning. Look at this Cali leaning, boy. What the hell? So I was able to get everything except for one thing and that's the aircraft stripper. So I'm gonna go to AutoZone and hope that they have it there. I also wanna see if they have uh, Mother's Mag polish because I wanna polish up the uh, lips on the Meisters. All right, boys, so AutoZone had the goods. Mag polish, some applicator pads, and a good old aircraft stripper, so that's a win. Right now I actually have to go to that freelance job that I mentioned and edit a video for them real quick and then after that I'm gonna be going to the shop and we will start the process on this thing of sanding it and stripping it and that all, all that good stuff. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Just got to the shop and the first... So the first thing that I'm gonna do is just take off things that don't need to be here and, and don't need to get painted, so the headlights, the side mirrors, the door molding, the emblems, I already took the front one off, the license plate, all that kind of stuff, antenna. So I'm just gonna do that real quick and get this thing looking good. Steve is not here yet, he'll be here in six, so an hour and a half from now or so. So when he gets here, we'll start sanding, but for right now, I'm just gonna start getting the car stripped of what it needs to uh, be stripped of. All right guys, so it's been about two hours now. I was able to get a lot of stuff off the car that I don't need when this thing's getting painted. I was able to take the corner lights out of both sides. I was gonna take the headlights out, but seeing as it won't come out unless you take the bumper off, it's good enough to just have them tucked back so that I can get into this lip and get this all protected on both sides. Very pleased with this though, I was able to get all three of these moldings on both sides off without breaking a single clip. I had to take the door panel off of both sides so that I could get into here and get to the clips from the inside and squeeze them and pop them off. So I'm still waiting on Steve to get here. He said that he'll be here soon. So when he gets here, we can start actually sanding the car, getting the car ready for paint. There's some Bondo stuff that we gotta do. So it should be interesting. Steve finally showed up today. And Yo, make sure you zoom in on that lineup. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, under the neck, under the neck. Ooh. Lift it, lift it. Ooh. I did that shit myself. Ooh. <laughs> so what's the first task? We're taking the emblem off. That's not an emblem, that's a sticker. It's a sticker. So we're gonna give that a peel. It's cold in here. I'm gonna try and get one of these from the dealer. Probably New OEM there. from the dealer. It's crying. Is that what you meant? See, it's crying. Rar XD! Rar XD! So while Steve is taping up around this stuff here in the taillights, I'm gonna go around other parts of the car with the tape and just tape things up and all that good stuff. <laughs> Will it work? It's orange, of course it's gonna work. What are you doing right now? We're making sure that I don't forget that there's any depth. I know there's one right here. From my, from my eye. Uh, you look. Oh yeah. Yeah. A little bit, oh yeah.
careful because it's not actually on the tripod. It's just resting on top of it. They get really good sleep. I'm chasing with the oh. <laughs> So we got the majority of the car sanded down. It's nice and smooth. There's a couple areas where we still have to do the body work, but we're probably gonna save that for tomorrow. Um, now, the hood was so bad that we decided to take it off and we are going to remove the paint with chemicals instead of actually just sanding it. So we already scuffed the hell out of the paint so that we can get the chemical to work in there and this aircraft stripper, which is Really potent stuff. Yes. Wear gloves. Yeah. You probably don't want to use latex, but that's what we have. And yeah, that's what we're going to use. Ew. <laughs> Damn. Why does it look like that? Maybe because it's cold? Probably. Shit. Long way. Paint come right off. This is all the paint that you put on. I know. It's like literally falling off. You enjoying that smart food? Yes, daddy. All right guys, so we got the hood outside. It's just getting snowed and rained on right now. So we just deactivates the uh, paint stripper. Two shots of what? Blueberry. <laughs> so, we got a good amount of work done tonight. Um, I'm gonna call it a night for this one. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> you know what it is. I hope you guys are excited. Miss you, Abby. <laughs> I hope you guys are as excited as I am to see this thing looking decent again. Shut up, Pierce. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow.